Hello everyone and welcome back to Red Dead Online. Today we are wearing white trousers and I have decided these are going to be my lucky pants. What I was thinking about doing is maybe trying some legendary bounties that I've never done before and whilst they are on cooldown I will try to make a bit of money from my moonshiner. So let's have a look at what is on offer. So I've done this one, I've done that one and that one. I haven't done Yukon Nick. Let's do Yukon Nick. He looks to be a bit of a bear person and I was kind of hoping he was going to be alone, but <laughs> apparently he's with a lot of people. I also didn't play the cutscene because I'm sure all of you have played these before. I'm just gonna ride over and see if we could do it without dying, maybe? As I said before, I have decided that I'm wearing my lucky pants. I just bought them, they're fresh, they're new, so we'll see if that helps with our endeavors. Hey, how could I do this? Oh my god! Hey! <laughs> I was gonna decide if I should go in on my horse or by myself, but to be honest, I think we'll stay on the horse for now. Where are you? There you, there you go. You. Alright. Definitely lucky pants. Look at that. I did forget to eat some food. Yeah. Excuse moi. I just need to uh, get a bit of uh, nourishment. Oh, it's a dog. Oh, I'm sorry, puppy. But you know, you're 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 a bad dog. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Let's have a bit of food. Nom nom. Plain pork. Ow. And I think I'll also have a bit of a health cure. Okay. I'm ready. Let's take them on. This is on the easiest difficulty, so I mean, if I do fail, then that's going to be humiliating. Oh, so far, so good. Could it be? Could it be that we we are not sucking anymore? I'm guessing Yukon Nick is in the hut. I hope I haven't killed him yet. I would like to take him in alive. That would be cool. Oh, the bear. Uh. <laughs> okay, that may be not a good idea. Go on, bear. Be free. Go kill them for me. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I thought he was coming after me for a minute. We're gonna call him Mole the Bear. Good job. Now you can run to freedom. <laughs> so, free dinner. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, my horse is like, screw that. Stop! We're coming up. Don't okay. shoot. Oh, my the character's looking here. good. Come for safety, huh? Huh? Hey, please. Looks like you have me cornered here. If I'm going down, you're going to. Oh gosh. There we go. I suppose you can't take them alive. But it's alright, buddy. I did it for you. I pro- Hey! Ugh. He's dead! There's no point. I'm just gonna lose your own life trying to save a bear man. Where's the bear, by the way? Yeah, definitely a bear. Eh, take down! Nope, that's my horse. Ooh, that is perfect. There we go. <laughs> we love a bit of explosion. Oh, 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 oh. Hello, hello there. Oh. Come here. There we go. Okay, the character's getting shaky hands. What the? Blimey. Die. Die. <laughs> this guy's like a cat. He has like nine lives. Oh my god. That. Oh. Wow. I need his lucky pants. Because, damn. Okay, this final shot. What? There we go. There we go. As an animal lover, I'm gonna put the bounty on my horse, get on my horse, and then I'll release the bear. Up you go. Horsey, don't freak out. Release the bear. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh my god. <laughs> don't kill the people who free you. I hear him roaring. He's just uh, <laughs> scaring the rider. Oh yeah, you have fun. We're gonna bring our bounty in. Some wild horses over there. I really, really want Red Dead to bring in the horse taming. You could have maybe your own sort of auctions from the wild horses that you catch. I don't know, what do you think? I think that would be really good. I'm sure other people have mentioned that they would like that as well. I mean, if we could do it in the story mode, it only makes sense that we could do it in online. Okay. Here you go, Yukon Nick, dead. 
That was a really interesting bounty. I enjoyed that. I thought it would be a bit more difficult, but I suppose it's only because it was on level one. So what I'm going to do now is I really, really need some money. Don't know what for yet. Actually, I think I might want to buy the bounty wagon so I can maybe do the uh, owl hoot family. I heard that one's really fun and I need, I need space for that. I can't, I only have these two little hands and lucky pants. It's not enough to take in a whole redneck family. My moonshine production has finished, so let's pop over to our moonshine shack and see what is happening. Let's go and see what Marcel is up to. I will have to do a couple of bootlegger missions just to bring the price of the moonshine down a bit. Let's sell it to... Lewis. As usual, we'll try not to break any bottles. So even if it does take us a bit longer, I would love to get the full price. Once. Just once. I just want to know if it's possible. What I also haven't had the pleasure of experiencing is the control point just letting you go. It always ends up being a shootout for me. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. Hey, okay, let's approach steadily. Cross our fingers and toes. They're not looking for moonshine. They're not looking for moonshine. Okay. <laughs> no. Why? Why can't you just let me brew in peace? And they've damaged my moonshine again. Oh no. I guess the rest of it is up to me. We'll try to take it steady anyway, even if we've lost a couple of dollars. Be following. <laughs> Do I come back here? Yeah. There's the guy that I had in one of my other videos. I think I should try to save him this time, maybe. What seems to be the problem here? Oh, it's a woman. Sorry, guys. Uh, reload. Uh. I'm gonna cut you, cut you loose, but that's that's the only thing I can do. Unless you're gonna get on my wagon and help me as well. No, I guess not. Oh well, have a good life, lady. Yeah, we have enemies coming. Oh, I remember I unlocked the skill that the NPCs are doing now. Where you can dog behind your horse. Is that her? Oh! <laughs> I almost blasted her in the face. Nah, she's safe. She's run off somewhere. So far we're looking good. We still have that one. Well, I think now it's two millimeter damage. From what I've seen in the past, it's probably gonna be about a $50 penalty. But we'll see. And then once we've done that, I also want to check out how my trader's doing. I believe I'm only a little bit away from being able to sell, and that's gonna be a nice $500. And I should be able to afford the bounty wagon then. Ah! Oh no! <laughs> oh, it's a deer. You know, they, they are like deer in the headlights. They just run in front of your wagon. You can't do anything about it. This is a really windy road. I don't like how much all my bottles are clanking, so I think I should slow down. Oh, careful. Easy. Okay, we're in the clear for now. They are still coming. Oh, no, they're going. Oh! No! <laughs> oh, no! We were almost there as well. Oh, well. We've done it, though. We broke two bottles, and what does that mean? Hmm, yeah, we lost about 40 odd dollars, but at least we ranked up, so that's good. All right, we'll return back to our shack and see if we can do a bootlegger. Maggie, Maggie, can we please have a bootlegger mission? Take out the revenue agents. Wow, that was a big jump. <laughs> they only seem to have one camp. That's good. It's the last time when I had two camps, that was uh, a massive fail. <laughs> we should do better in this one. Hello there. All right, how shall we do this? I think we just run and gun as usual. There's no other way. Uh, I think I should move around a bit. Oh no! Horsey! Me! Oh no! Ugh, not lucky pants. Well, then again, I mean, I should have moved around a bit. I wonder if I can save my horse in time. Okay, okay. I gotta do this quick. I want to save my horse. Where's the other one? Okay, it doesn't matter. I'm coming, Adrenis. Okay, you're okay, you're okay. Oh! No! Oh. oh no, he died. Come on. It's either you or me. There we go. Okay, how long do I have to wait to get my poor horse back? Am I getting the scrawny nag? Yeah, it's definitely not Adrenis. They've put, his, uh, put her name on him, but 
It's actually a really nice looking horse. I love the stripe on the back. I'll ride this one for a bit and then I'll see if I can get my poor little Adreni's back. Aww. I think I made a mistake. I was trying to get Adreni's back, so I dismissed the uh, scrawny nag and now I have to go by foot. But anyways, I'm running to my camp now and I will see if I can do a bit of a trading mission just to get that money and buy our little bounty wagon finally. So I'm one good away from being able to sell my trading. I can utilize the bonus that Rockstar gave me and order supplies for free. So that's what we'll do. So how long does it take? Supplies arriving soon. So I think while I'm waiting for the supplies to arrive, I could see if there are any animals around. That's a two star. I usually only go for the three star animals, but it does appear that there are some deer running around. So I'll see if I can find the three star or maybe some turkeys. We can get a quick rabbit though. So which one of you is three star? That one. Sorry, buddy. I need you for my goods. Uh-huh, three star white tail deer. So let's just sneak over with our trusty bow. We have two three stars. Okay, I wonder if I can quickly shoot that one. Okay, we'll lasso this one and we'll bring both back to our camp. And that should be absolutely more than enough to get our production finished. Here you go, Crips. We have Supplies a few animals. Supplies still haven't arrived. Would have been quicker to just do a resupply mission yourself, I think. Yay! Our trader's finished. Hey, let's start a local delivery. Good. The one thing I really love about delivering trading goods is that you don't have to be overly careful. I mean, uh, I have destroyed my wagon a couple of times by making it fall off a cliff, but at least you don't have to worry about little bumps in the road. I do like the realism that they've applied to the Moonshiner deliveries though, because you are transporting glass bottles, but it's always nice for a change to make a bit of money without having to worry about the little things. There we are super simple mission and five hundred dollars are mine oh over a grand yes i can absolutely afford a bounty wagon i might try to find madame nazar and sell her some of my spare cards and collectibles in this episode we will have focused purely on making money with a little bit of fun on the side and i think in the next episode actually i'll focus more on the legendary bounties and i think the owl hoots are the ones that I want to do. So let's go over to the stables now and I will purchase the bouncy wagon so it's nice and ready for us when we want to use it. I would like to purchase a bouncy wagon. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it's on discount. Oh, how lucky is that? Yes, please. <laughs> Why does it keep launching me out with the wagon? I want my horse, please. We can't forget the ammo, of course. I am trying to prepare for the legendary bounty. So I think this is where I will end this episode. And in the next one, I'm gonna try the Owl Hoot family for the first time. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next episode. Bye bye.